Today, we will talk about how to open a liquor store. Let's have a look at the details. Opening a liquor store can be a great way to ensure a steady income because people drink alcohol in both good times and bad. However, that same inflexibility in demand contributes to low profit margins meaning you're unlikely to get rich with just one store. In addition, retail alcohol sales are heavily regulated, and it can be difficult for an interested business person to know where to start. Nonetheless, with proper counsel and wise strategies to boost traffic, your store can be a reliable income stream for years to come. The first step is preparing to open your store. Find a suitable location. The success of your liquor store is inextricably connected to its location. Hire a lawyer. It isn't always easy to be sure you're abiding by state, county, and municipal laws. So, the best advice to give about licensing is to hire an attorney familiar with the local laws and let them guide you through the process. Research the market around your chosen location. Create sales and cost projections. The market analysis is meant to give you a good idea of your customer base. Obtain financing if necessary. As a rule of thumb, a new business owner should use as little financing for a startup as possible. This rule applies to liquor stores too, but since the demand for alcohol is more or less fixed, many lenders will regard a liquor store as an unusually safe investment. Register with the Alcohol and Tobacco Tax and Trade Bureau. Buy your inventory. This is going to be your biggest expense. A well-stocked liquor store will have millions in inventory sitting on the shelves. Consider hiring an employee or two might help you operate more efficiently than you would otherwise be able to. And, the second step is keeping it profitable. Hold wine tastings or mixology classes. While this isn't always an option due to local laws, if it is legal in your area, classes like these are a great way to keep consistent traffic inside the store. Suggest food pairings. As the sommeliers say, what grows together, goes together. Suggesting food pairings to go along with beer, wine, and spirits can be a great way to cultivate an air of expertise, which will appeal to higher-end customers. Boost your online presence. Create a high-quality, professional website, start an email list, and encourage your customers to post online reviews. Get active on social media and announce Flash Loss Leader specials. Sponsor local events. A good way to ingratiate yourself in the community is by sponsoring local events like festivals and concerts. Request promotional items from distributors. Most distributors will keep you stocked with new displays, swag, and signage. Make sure you keep it updated because it will make your store seem fresh. Selling to underage customers, even by mistake, can cost you thousands in fines and can even put your livelihood in jeopardy. Stay on the right side of the law. Thanks for watching this video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel if you like our videos.